A group in North Carolina says an investigation into Postmaster General Louis DeJoy needs to start right now. They filed a complaint and want the state attorney general to look into whether DeJoy committed crimes with regard to political contributions. Our Capitol reporter Michael Hyland is live in Raleigh. And Michael, the people behind this new complaint say they hope, they hope all the work being done for this election doesn't put this on hold. Right, this nonpartisan group, Common Cause, came here to the State Board of Elections about this, and they're concerned that this whole situation could undermine people's trust in elections. Postmaster General Louis DeJoy was a major Republican fundraiser in North Carolina before taking over at the Postal Service. This week, a report by the Washington Post detailed allegations that he pressured employees at his company, New Breed Logistics, to make donations to candidates. The company's HR director told the Post DeJoy would later reimburse them with bonuses. That's a felony, if that's true. That is against the North Carolina election laws we have, and we think it should be investigated. Bob Phillips is executive director of Common Cause, a nonpartisan advocacy group in Raleigh. His group filed this complaint with the State Board of Elections calling for an investigation and sent this letter to State Attorney General Josh Stein asking him to look into whether any crimes were committed. It might be a way of expediting, kind of getting uh, something moving on this. It comes with less than two months to go until the election. We certainly don't want this to be or do anything that interferes with what their primary duty is right now, and that is to uh, make sure we have a, a safe and secure election. And uh, there is some concerns about the timing of this. A spokesman for DeJoy says he was never notified of employees feeling pressured to donate, and he sought advice from a former attorney for the Federal Election Commission. Attorney General Stein did not indicate how quickly an investigation would move. I thought that the allegations contained in the story were very serious. Leaders of Common Cause say they're also considering reaching out to the district attorneys here in Wake County, where the elections board is, and also in Guilford County, where DeJoy's business is based. Live in Raleigh, Michael Hyland, CBS 17 News.